Hi, Hi fellow birdies, birdies, and welcome back to another edition of Songbirds Eating Show. In today's video, we're going to be playing another game of Would You Rather? Yes. Would you rather do this or that? <laughs> so we got some tasty homemade cheese pizza made using a pizza crust um, from Costco that I recently found. And we also have some boneless chicken wings and... But I would consider the best dip is ranch, right? Mm -hmm. You can't have pizza without ranch. Well, at least us. But, you know, everyone's different. So we got some good questions lined up, and we're going to go ahead and get started. Mm -hmm. The first one. Would you rather be the best in the world at climbing trees or jumping rope? Hmm. Honestly, like, I like the thought of climbing trees. Like, or like just in case someone's after me, i will be able to escape from them. I Jump just climbing trees as well. Just be able to climb things. Like, if you can climb trees, you can probably climb other things very well, too. Yeah. Like, imagine being <laughs> like, you know, Spider-Man up the house. <laughs> yeah, or like, climb a tree house, um, a tree, and not have to worry about building ladders for a tree house. You can just, like, climb up to your tree house. I've never been, like, really much into skipping rope, or jumping rope, rather. Mm -hmm. Like, when I have tried to, like, jump rope, it's just been, I keep messing up. <laughs> You know, like, flat out in the bat. Mm -hmm. Of course, I can imagine that for you, too. What do you mean? I never really fail at jumping rope. <laughs> well, I've never, really, I've never seen jump Yeah, I've never seen jump rope. So, the next one. Would you rather never have to clean a bathroom again or never have to do dishes again? Bathroom. Bathroom for me, too. Like, I don't mind doing the dishes. I can probably have the dishes washed if there's a bunch of them within 10 or 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. It's very simple, very easy, or just put in the dishwasher. Cleaning a bathroom, on the other hand, for me, is a lot more painstaking work. Because you got like, you know, clean the sink, clean the tub, toilet, and water. <laughs> All that stuff, so yeah. I'm much the same way, frankly. <laughs> like, it just seems much grosser to clean the bathroom. Would you rather have taste buds covering your hands, or not taste... Food and drink again. Taste I'd rather have, yeah, my hands. Like, I don't want to lose the ability to taste food and my drink. Because I love tasting the stuff. The stuff's awesome. Plus, that would be a, a great reason for a brand new invention. The, you know, you know fried yeah, chicken gloves. If I taste it with your hands, it's like you could taste it before you put it in your mouth to see if it's good. Well, right? to be fair, you'd be tasting everything you touch. But that would yeah. just mean, you know, like I said, an excuse to create the fried chicken gloves. Like, you'd be tasting metal if you put it on, like, a pipe <clears throat> and all that stuff. <laughs> Ew. Or, say if you accidentally, like, spray disinfectant on the table and you touch it. Yeah, yeah, I hope you don't get poisoned from that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a chance that you could get poisoned from that, probably. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, be careful. Next one. Would you rather have skin like sandpaper or skin like jelly? That's a hard one. <laughs> kind of like, I don't know why, but I like the thought of jelly. Maybe I could like jump easier. Would it be like, you know, someone can pull it off easy? I don't know. It's so, like, it would be really loose. That's a tough one for me. <laughs> sandpaper... I wouldn't be able to ever touch you because you would be feeling too rough. Mm -hmm. So I would probably think you want jelly, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> you haven't scared her for a moment. <laughs> That's not a bad pizza. The crust is a bit thin, but, you know, it's not bad. I had some mozzarella cheese on it, and it actually comes with the sauce, too. Mm -hmm. Would you rather make a beeping noise when you're stressed? Or cry confetti when you're sad. <laughs> One moment. <laughs> Me? I don't like being stressed, but I like confetti. So I guess I'd be crying all the time. It would be like a huge pity party when... <laughs> Literally. <laughs> I'm not crying confetti. It was a pity party. Please don't throw a pity party. <laughs> mm -hmm. For me? Beep. 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 <laughs> Oh god. It would be like the oven going off over and over again or what am I thinking about a car? You know like when you set the car alarm? Mm. Beep, beep. Or um 
your um, alarm clock. Mm -hmm. Oh God, I, I would hate having to listen to it all the time. <laughs> oh Lord. <laughs> <laughs> uh, would you rather only be able to sleep for three hours a night or have to run a marathon each week with shoes that are too tight I'll be honest with you like I'd rather have three hours of sleep every night because actually already I only get like about typically six to seven hours mm -hmm. so I'm kind of used to it <laughs> Well, it's in, if I follow the exact wording of each, I think I'd rather the three hours because it doesn't say I can only have three hours sleep per day, just per night. So I could sleep five hours during the day, three hours at night. True. But like, I wouldn't want to, yeah, and also I wouldn't want to wear shoes that are too tight. Like, I've had things happen in the past sometimes, just like my shoes are like rubbed against my skin or something. It's caused like blisters, like. I, mm -hmm. I can't stand it. I'd rather get less sleep instead of bare pain. Same here. But if it wasn't for that, I probably would have chosen the you know shoes. Simply because, one, I'd be in shape more. Mm -hmm. Two, <laughs> like... But there's ways... And basically, it might be too tight. But maybe I could like put like some like thick socks or something. I don't know. Would you rather turn into a dog every time you sneeze... Or a buffalo every time you hiccup. <laughs> God. I'd rather turn into a dog. I like dogs. <laughs> but like, but like, um, I would be turning into a dog every freaking time I sneeze. And I sneeze a lot. You know, especially more so this past week because it's springtime. Mm -hmm. So I guess if we turn into a dog all the time, if you hear me like bark, bark at you for every single thing that I do. <laughs> I'd be a buffalo. Simply because I'm only going to turn into it like once every you. Know, like week, every couple weeks or so. <laughs> well, yeah, both buffaloes and dogs are cool. Mm -hmm. It's really hard to choose, but yeah, I'd rather probably be a dog. Would you rather have your name constantly mispronounced or constantly forgotten? That's the one. It's already that, constantly. Mispronounced. I'd rather have it mispronounced because I just, you know, I I would feel bad if someone forgot my name or if I forgot their name. I guess I would rather like mispronounce it, but like. I would hope I would pronounce it right one of these times. Mm -hmm. So, at least for me. Would you rather be followed everywhere by someone playing the flute or be surprised daily by someone playing the tuba? Hmm. The flute for me because I really like how it sounds more than a tuba. Um, flute's pleasant, like... I, I even know of a you know musician who plays the flute, Lizzo. Um, she I've seen her play the flute a lot of times in her concerts and stuff, and that's really cool. I really like her flute playing skills. And um, but tuba, that, that's a big you know thing to be carrying around. <laughs> Honestly, I essentially choose you know, flute because I'd be living my life with a flute soundtrack, <laughs> which is kind of like a benefit in a way. Well, at least not full of the downside. Mm -hmm. Would you rather have knives for toes or have spaghetti for body hair? <coughs> spaghetti for body hair. I don't know why. I just don't like the idea of my toes being sharp. Same here. It would literally cut into anything and everything. <laughs> or, yeah. That's a no go for me. Spaghetti for body hair for me because. Well, that way it's a benefit. I'd be, you know. You could eat. You could eat your. I don't know how it goes, but you could eat your body hair anytime you want to. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I got all spaghetti. the spaghetti I want. <laughs> oh, it's spaghetti. Mm -hmm. <laughs> would you rather always miss film endings or never be able to finish a sentence? I would rather miss film endings. Like, there's some films I don't mind missing the endings of, but I would like to be able to complete my sentence. Like, I don't like. Maybe a sentence, like a run-on sentence or something like that. I always like finishing my sentences. I'm very picky about my grammar. You know? Plus, you'd always even be interrupted. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'd have to do the first one. I mean, <laughs> I, right. You know, so <laughs> without being able to you know, finish a sentence, I can't write, ever. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it would be the world's weirdest you know, 
story where like every single sentence is interrupted by something. That wouldn't even make for a story, really. Like, I feel like it can't be a story without a sentence. It's like if it's constantly going, mm -hmm. I'm gonna lose my track of thought reading right away. <laughs> Why not? Would you rather constantly be too hot or never quite dry? Never quite dry. Maybe too. Because I don't like being hot. Same. Although it's kind of hot to be hot. Ain't it? That's just a hot feeling. <laughs> okay, I'm joking. I'm not joking. It's not cool to be hot all the time. But like in the wintertime, yes. I think I'd rather be hot. But like, I'd rather not, not be quite dry because... Mm. You know, sometimes I like the feeling of, like, moisture in my skin or whatever like that. Like, say, after I take a bath or if I wash my face or something. It just feels cooling and comfortable. Well, think of it this way. Never quite dry. It depends on the semantics there. Like, does it mean that you're always wet? Or does it mean that, like, um, you're never, like, you know, skin cracking? Because that'd be actually a benefit. <laughs> I'm going to take it as never skin cracking, and then I get all the benefits. <laughs> Would you rather always try to open a door incorrectly or always stub your toe going up the stairs? Door. I don't want to like deal with toe pain going up the stairs. I wouldn't be able to go up the stairs that way, would I? No. So, I guess I'd like to always try to open a door incorrectly, but eventually I would open it correctly. Does it say that? It says always. Um... Duh. Well, I guess that's a hard one, honestly. Mm -hmm. Maybe I would rather stop my towel. <laughs> Although it would be painful as heck. But I want to be able to open doors because, hey, I'm trying to go somewhere, you know? Yeah, plus, depending on how you read it, like, for doors, would it mean, like, you know, you'd never be able to get in a car? Mm -hmm. You'd never be able to. Like, leave the house? You know, really, you know, like, use the bathroom? <laughs> Slipping a toe is easier to get around because it's a lot easier to, you know, live in a home with, like, all ramps mm -hmm. than a home with no doors. Then we got one more question. Would you rather become a plane or become a car? A plane because... It travels faster than a car. I like getting to my destinations quickly, and although I'd be worried about getting into a plane crash. For me, a car. Hmm. Why because, so? as, yeah, you can get faster to destinations than a plane, but you can only go to places that have a runway. You basically live your life in the airport, or <laughs> outside the airport. I guess with a car, you can see the sights and stuff more, too. Mm -hmm. A lot, so I can see your point. But, for me, I just want to get to my destination quicker. Mm -hmm. Plus, planes are kind of fun. <laughs> because they go fast. Like, <clears throat> Yep, yep. This is, I mean, you know, you know, what is it? Gosh, what's that song? It's like, Highway to the Danger. Highway to the Danger Zone. Yes, that's one. Yeah, off by Kenny Loggins uh, from the 1980s. So, mm -hmm. you know, foot lo Footloose and stuff like that. Mm hmm so, yeah, really good stuff. Anyway, guys, that's all the time we have for today's Would You Rather. I hope you enjoyed it, and there'll definitely be many more to come. Mm -hmm. Also, don't forget to click that red button down below to subscribe and... Hit the bell for notifications, and we'll see you folks in the next video. This is Crystal. And Charles. Bye, Bye, birdies. birdies.